What is going on, everyone? This is AJ. And tonight, we are playing Magic the Gathering Online. And if you're here looking for ultra high level gameplay, if you're here looking for tips and tricks to get the advantages in the next time that you're playing Magic the Gathering, Stop this video right now. Because you won't find it here. This is going to be a journey. A long journey. In our journey, we are going to try to go from a complete Magic the Gathering noob. Someone who's played for a total of three months in their life. And that was about six and a half or seven years ago. So we're going to see how far we could come uh, playing both MTGO and MTGA. Um, the little I know about both, uh, I know I enjoy, for some reason, I really enjoy watching MTGO. I'm maybe the only one, um, because uh, again, I'll I'll have a lot of time to ramble. <laughs> I will be rambling. Um, so uh, basically, I played Magic: The Gathering during Shadows over Innistrad, um, and I didn't play much online. At that point, I gathered my courage in 2016. I believe it was probably May, May of 2016, and gathered all my courage. And without knowing anything about the game other than you need to put lands down and you need to tap those lands for mana, and then you need to put your cards down. Other than that, I had no idea what I was doing, and I'm not much much better today. Um... And I played draft. I drafted, you know, once a week at my local game store. Uh, and I did that halfway through from Shadows of it, Over in Estrad. Then I played the pre-release and drafted Eldritch Moon. I did the pre-release for Kaladesh. But then, like, maybe a week after Kaladesh came out, I believe I lost my job at the time. And uh, Magic the Gathering can be quite expensive if you don't have any friends to play, like Kitchen Table. So I haven't really played. Uh, I tried I tried teaching a, a couple of, you know, like, friends or girlfriends how to play. Um, but when you don't know how to play very well, it's not, <laughs> it's not the most fun for them either. And our first match um, in seven years... Oh, uh, did go swimmingly, as you could see. Um, game one. I don't know if there was, this was like best of three. This is the MTGO. This is a brand new account because uh, we we did have an account seven years ago, but uh, it didn't have any kind of like it just was drafting. So if I could find that, I could find it. But if not, it's not a big deal. So. This is a new to magic AFR sealed, phantom sealed. So we don't get to keep the cards. I guess that's what phantom means. Um, and I would started a video earlier, but it was just taking too long to look at cards that are not even standard legal anymore. Uh, and building a deck that's not standard legal because I had no idea what the cards did or said. We, we have a three color really bad deck right now. Uh, and I went to concede the game, and I think I conceded the match, unless this is like a one number of stages, one stage, one stage, three matches, single game match. Okay. So that makes sense. Um, but, uh, since 2016, I've, I've, I've kept up with, uh, with magic. I, I'm lucky enough to... Uh, work from home full time. So, a lot of times I, I watch a lot of stuff on YouTube. Um, I vary from 
you know, documentaries to gaming and all that stuff. So um, I've always kept my eye on. Um, absolutely always have loved uh, Seth from uh, MTG Goldfish. Uh, he's just so, like, first of all, he's pretty good at magic. For, at my, to, compared to me. <laughs> And he's always so um, entertaining and, uh, you know, high energy. I'm not high energy at all, uh, hence my YouTube name, Apathetic AJ. I'm kind of just there, <laughs> kind of just like, uh, all right, I guess we'll play Magic. Um, uh, so uh, a lot of the other guys I, I also like from uh, MTG Goldfish. I just can't remember their names, and I'm sorry. Um, uh I think the one of the few people I subscribe to on my uh, other YouTube account is the professor because I, you know, like how could you not like the professor? Uh, at least his videos. I don't know him personally, obviously. Um, limited resources, uh, and that's where I think limited resources uh, would get me like in the mood. To play. Um, so for the reason that I'm doing this now. All right. I think we'll keep that. <laughs> I think we'll keep that. So, yes. Uh, limited resources uh, for us. We. Oh. I have that one too. Uh, in just about all the sets, like, but only the kind of the sets that I would uh, think I'd be interested in. Okay, so let's throw it down and take one. Uh, I would listen to Limited Resources with uh, Marshall and Luis and kind of just be like, wow. They are on curve here, and we are not. We'll do black, green, black. Do that, and then just get out of here. I would listen to uh, limited resources and kind of listen to them in the background while I'm at work because some of those episodes are what, like the the commons and the uncommons are five hours. I couldn't imagine. Like it's, I'm so you're so thankful for them doing that, but I just couldn't imagine. You know, like I don't, I don't have five hours uh, of my day to sit down and. Uh, to watch that, so it's good that I could do that at work. All right, we're getting stomped here. I wish one of them had flying. Um, I don't know. Okay, cool. Um, I guess we hold up bar the gate and hope they play something. Hope they play something big. Um, but yeah, the, uh, this new, uh, I, I want to always call it all for one. Um, and I, I was joking around earlier that all for one, I think was a like a rap reggae group or something from the nineties, as well as a Brian Adams song. Yeah, we're just getting stomped here. So we would like a I don't even know. I don't even know what will help us right now. Jeez, we would like another blue source. That's what we'd like. Alright, you may play.
playing additional lands on each of your turns. So it's green and... Okay, so we... Ugh. Oh boy. Uh, the new Phyrexian set. So that looks really, really, really cool. Um, and I wanted to try it. So that's why we're trying magic again. This guy doesn't need to do anything else other than what he's doing. Oh boy. Sacrifice an artifact or creature. Jeez. Yeah, I don't think I don't think we can do anything here. Okay, so I think, what do I do? What do I do here? Yeah, I think that, do we tap out? I, yeah, I don't even know. I'd love another blue source. Okay. I don't know. We'll fight. We will fight. I'd like another... Well, I guess it doesn't even matter anymore. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't matter. One more blue source would be nice. Let's see if we can do something fun. It's probably going to go terribly, terribly wrong. So I think that we try to block. And then when we block, we get this. And then we get that. Will that work? Unless you're just going to kill this. Oh, and then tapped out blue, of course. Uh, enter the target creature and opponent controls gets that.
Well, that's cool. Okay. It's not like we're stabilizing, but we're fighting. Hmm. Okay, so we can leave counter up. Three of three. Destroy a target artifact. Luckily, I could play two lands. Oof, I don't even know. I think that... <sighs> like, I have a feeling he's going to... We got it. We got a block. I mean, I'm sure he's got something. That's fine. It's a good card. Wish I had that card. But yeah, I might be repeating myself, but, uh, for the records, it is Saturday, February. Okay, so we have a one. So let's play our Death Touch. Um, and I guess we play. I guess we just have to play everything, right? Four one, yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess we keep that. So yes, today is uh, Saturday, February eighteenth, twenty twenty three. So yeah, we're gonna see where we can go with this. We're not gonna play a lot. I mean, it's expensive. We're like I said, maybe one, two drafts a week. Um, and hopefully we get better. Hopefully we learn. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. I love magic. Uh, it's a little bit nerve. Like, I'm I'm not sure if you could tell. I'm very nervous right now. Uh, and, and I'm sure I've said this before. Uh, if you see something in my gameplay that you're like, wow, here's what you're doing wrong. Change this right now. Definitely let me know. Uh, enchant creature. Well, he's not completed a dungeon. That's a 1-1. One, one. That's fine. Uh, 
Okay. Okay, so. Go on attack, I dare you. Cool. I know we're trading in a good card for a that, but we have just no life left. Yeah, I guess the, uh, again, the purpose of this is to see how far we could come. And we'll utilize all kinds of... resources for us. Okay. So... I'd like to counter, but we definitely need some board state here. That one toughness is just terrible. And again, I'm not sure if I said it. I think our goal is right now we're hot garbage. We haven't played in seven years. No idea what we're doing. And right now we're playing it AFR. <laughs> uh, okay, cool. I won't give it that. Uh, our goal is to go from hot garbage to lukewarm garbage. Hopefully we can get there. I'm sure these two cards in his hand are like... Okay, no, Hunter. Okay, so... So yeah, we kill their thing either way, and then this gets a plus one, plus one, which I'm okay with. Why didn't I get that? Oh, whenever it attacks. Oh, jeez, that's dumb. There you go. Read the cards. Read the cards. Pump it. Does this do anything? Each player loses two life unless they discard a card. Yeah, I can discard a card. Huh. 
I don't know if this format has like lightning bolt kind of thing that could just zap me. Destroy target. Oh, that's cool. We're fighting. We're fighting. <laughs> we're not going to win, but we're fighting. Oh, each player, each player loses one life. Uh, you gain one life. There we go. We'll do that. Oh, that's kind of nice. So what do we have? Instance. I think we gotta level that up. anything Where are we? <laughs> I hope they tap out to play a big dragon beat and then we just blast it. Okay, well we could blast that. So, are we actually going to win? Because we can... We can... Kill that. Swinging for six.
right? No way. This one I might have to watch again if we win. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, wait a minute. Black, black. No, we don't have enough for that. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. I just saw this. That's an artifact creature bird. All right, what do we got? Swamp. Gain one life. All right, well, we got that instant, too. Wow. Oof. Wow. That was... That was crazy. <laughs> and that's one match. Um... I'll do longer videos. Uh, this is just a kind of an introduction. And let me let me introduce myself again. If you made it this far, we'll talk some more. We, we shall talk some more. Um, my name's AJ. If I'm repeating myself, I'm sorry. I'm AJ. Uh, I'm originally from the East Coast, Northeast. I uh, have been living in the Midwest for far too long right now. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm not a young person. I'm not that old, though. I have two dogs. I'm sure you've heard them barking during this episode. I don't do much editing on my YouTube channel, so dogs barking are in there. What you'll also hear is a child probably screaming, singing, laughing. Um, so I have uh, two dogs. I have a uh, pit bull mutt who's about eh, 70 pounds. Uh, that's about three years old. We rescued her, and we just picked up, uh, two or three months ago, we picked up a uh, Rottweiler puppy. Uh, and I have a two-year-old child, two-year-old son. Uh, so there's going to be some background noises, most definitely. Uh, there's going to probably be uh, no face cam. So if you're like, oh, I only want to watch YouTubers with a face cam... Uh, you're probably not going to get that. Reason for that is that I do have a uh, client facing uh, full time job, and I don't need to be on the internet. I mean, like this is just a hobby. If I, if I was making money on this, then maybe I would think about it. But uh, this is just a hobby for me. Uh, no need to show my face and somebody get angry at me for saying like, "Oh, I don't like playing." With white cards. Oh, he doesn't like playing with white cards. I'm going to tell his boss that he's a terrible person. Get him fired. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, just a hobby. So, hopefully we uh, we can uh, move forward. Become a okay magic player. But we'll see. Uh, like I said, today's our first episode. And first of many. Um, I'm still going to be doing my... MMORPGs as well. Uh, but I'm going to pepper this in because I really enjoyed That was really fun. That match was 12 minutes long and uh, we got down to one health for the longest time. That There was like no way that we were going to win. I was going to happily concede that match. Um, but I'm glad we didn't. There we go. We had our first win on recording. and that's, We haven't had very many wins uh, other than that anyway, so... I hope you enjoyed it. Um, 
definitely if you see if you see something in my play that you're like what are you doing uh leave a comment uh i'm very open to trying to get better only way i'm going to get better is by playing and by listening to people who are smarter than me which is probably you so uh thanks again for watching take her easy